other questions? All right. Well, Catherine, thank you so much. You know, I have to say, you know, I'm always impressed with Visa's willingness to be open about what you're building and how you are contributing back. So, you know, part of the Hyperledger Foundation and open source in general is being able to tell the stories publicly. Um, and I know it's very hard sometimes for Catherine to get approval to talk. Um, so what we saw today was a really, you know, great presentation. Um, and we look forward to having everybody, you know, who wants to learn more um, participating. There's a lot of work happening right now in Brazil. We have a very active regional chapter. If you speak Portuguese, you'll follow if you speak Portuguese, uh, join our regional chapter in Brazil, um, and we're uh, looking forward to hosting many of many folks in Brazil as well. So thank you, Catherine, for thank you joining for us. Me. All right, and. Uh, Hopefully Catherine will be around. If you have questions for her, she can assist as well. So we have uh, one more presentation. Um, and Ken, come on up. Uh, Ken is with Hitachi. He's one of the researchers at Hitachi um, working with the Hyperledger projects. And he'll tell you a bit about it. Um, Hitachi has been a member of the Hyperledger uh, Foundation since 2016. Um, they were actually, I don't know, Ken, if you know this or not, but Hitachi was the first member to sign the membership agreement for the Hyperledger project in 2016. So they've been here quite a while. They also sit on our governing board, so they're premier members of the foundation, and very importantly, doing projects really diverse. And we're gonna talk a bit about biometrics, uh, the applications that Ken is gonna do a presentation, and he's also going to do a live demo. So we're gonna have a live demo in between the section here.